Hi guys, it's Dawn from Let's Make a Mess. How are you doing today? Welcome to the vlog. Uh, this vlog is going to start out with me trying to go to a bakery and it being closed and then finally the next day I went and then I got all the goodies that I wanted to get. Oh my God, so delicious. I love a really good bakery, you guys. Like, I mean, I really love a good bakery. Oh my gosh. So you'll see that. And then um, I ended up eating that in the front seat of my car with a friend of mine. We pigged out. It was like, we ended up cutting it with like a credit card because we didn't have a knife. Oh my gosh, crazy days. Anyway, and then I drove to Daiso in the valley, the San Fernando Valley, so you'll see that. So that was a lot of fun. And so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I'll be right back to uh, button it up for you, okay? See you in a minute, bye. So I'm gonna try to find a, a there's a pastry place in here that I've been hearing about. And I'm dying to, I used to go in there when it was a different bar and there's years ago. God, I haven't been here in so long. Oh, I didn't know that this is cute little, oh, cute little cards and gifts. We are the people our parents warned us about. <laughs> cute, I didn't know that was here. This is a cute little place. It's lunchtime. And there it is, Carrara Pastries. Ooh. That's a good, he goes over there, I've been in there. I've seen the Kardashians there too, by the way. Um, this is where I wanna go, and they look closed. Are they closed? Monday closed. Really? Oh, I wanted some pastry today. I guess it's a good thing that they're closed. Oh, I'm so loud. Oh well. All right, you guys. Well, that was just a little, this is a little mall that used to, um, it's always been had this, but this is, they've kind of update, updated it a little bit. That was a Mexican restaurant before, I don't know what it is now. So, jeez. Um, Look, I love those bowls. They're like bread bowls. If you ever see those in the thrift stores, grab them. Like, they, why they're for meeting or something. All right, you guys, back to the work with no pastry. Ugh. Hey guys, welcome to the going into the seventh week um, of the retirement vlog. And I just left, that's the 101 up there. <laughs> We're on a, a side road and we just left the Wizens Shopping Center. For those of you from Southern California, you know where the Wizens is in Agora, right? Um, yeah, it is uh, just a landmark that's been there forever. and. I heard that they had a really good pastry store in there. I haven't been there in years. And so I went in to go to the pastry store today. It's Monday and it's closed on Monday. So I think I was saved by the bell. Anyway, so I guess I'm just gonna have to go back to the office and eat my salmon and green beans like a good girl. But anyway, so I thought I'd take you along with me. This week, I don't know what I'm into. Uh, not going. There's not much going on still. I'm still just walking and I'm not sure what all I'm doing in order to prepare for my retirement, except for that each week that goes by, I feel a little more um, mentally prepared uh, for the big move. So, I mean, every day that I look at the boxes that are lined up in my apartment, my little cramped apartment, and every day that I, um, I have to get up and go to my soul-sucking job is more reason for me to prepare and to get ready to go to Oregon and, and to be in my house. So, and not to mention the fact, and I've mentioned it before, of the double bill, <laughs> the double expenses. Look how pretty the mountains are right now. This is Agora Road and uh, it's pretty here. So anyway, oh, I was gonna show you guys something. I'm gonna do it. Let's take another really quick little um, detour right now. Okay, so this is Agora Road and um, those houses right there inside there are like $800,000 houses and they've been here a while. But I wanna show you these other houses. They're fairly new and I watched them come up or be built and I always thought they were beautiful, right? They have the, the um, brick you know, facing on the front. I don't know if that's what you call it. The brick on the front and stuff. And I thought, oh my God, those are so beautiful, so beautiful. And I went online to, ooh, that little bird. I went online to see how much they were. And again, these things are probably, oh, I just missed it. Dang it, in there. I wanna turn, oh, let me see. Let me get in there, here. So anyway, look at these houses. Let's, I'm curious. Okay, so these are a little bit bigger than the, the ones on the other side. 
These are million dollar homes right now. But look at this little house right here. Do you see that little house right there? Look at the brick. Like mine kind of has that kind of brick facing. Of course, it's not like one of these major mansions right here. It's like a real small house. But the one I got in Eugene, I'm gonna go a little um, personal here, was, uh, I'm gonna turn around. Cause these are huge. That is huge. These are big homes. I almost said that big A word homes. But yeah, so, oh my God, you guys look at that view. Look at that view. Can you imagine what it's like from the house? Pretty. I wanna go back down the street and go to the smaller ones because so these houses in Eugene would probably be $500,000 okay there are a million dollar houses here just I'm just saying look how close they're just like the ones I just bought in Eugene like that's a small one and I bet you that's a million dollars right there but I want to go back to the other the other street and show you because that one these are more like the size of the house that I bought I think they might be a little bigger but this, the, this, the style is the same. That's what I'm, this one right here. Oh my gosh, you guys. Like this has got a little bit more to it than mine does. But you guys, that's the same style. I have a porch just like that. Wait till you see, I should take a picture of that. I'm gonna, I can't. Yeah, I took a picture of that because I'll show you like my house compared to these houses. Like these do look bigger. I'm not kidding, but are they worth that much? I mean, really? So no, it's crazy. It's crazy how expensive Southern California is. So I'm really pleased with the little house that I got um, in Eugene. I'm glad I didn't have to spend $800,000 to get it. It was, it was in the threes, okay? So yeah, this is a bigger garage, but basically you guys, same, same, same kind of neighborhood. I'm really excited to have a house like that. Isn't that pretty? But I don't think they're worth $800,000. I seriously just do not think they're worth $800,000. Okay, so I'm gonna turn around up here and, um, so anyway, I'll talk so to you So this is what I actually got you guys. These are so good, I had one. I also had one of those things in the little spoon right there, but this is to take with me, and um, I don't know when I'm, or, or how I'm going to eat all that, but I don't think it's going to be hard. Oh my gosh, you guys, this place is so cute, and I had, and look at my box, isn't it pretty? So it was like 20 something dollars, but I got a whole bunch of stuff, and I might bring it to work tomorrow if it makes it, or I might just keep it for me because I'm not feeling everybody at work right now anyway. But mm, mm, mm. isn't it nice to just go find a place with some nice pastry once in a while, you guys, instead of just a donut shop? Which there's nothing wrong with a regular donut shop, but there's something really special about a wonderful pastry shop. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it. We finally got to see it. So I'm gonna go. It's getting cold here. It's gonna rain again. But yeah. Okay. Morning, guys. It's Thursday morning, and as you can see, it's raining again in SoCal which doesn't bother me a bit. I just didn't pick the best shoes today. I don't know if you can see down there, but I have my flip-flops on, like really on. But anyway, I just wanted to get online and touch base today because I haven't done much vlogging this week. It's just been kind of a, just a dead week. You know, I had a little bit of drama and I just kind of didn't feel like sh sharing too much. So um, yeah, but I did go into the um, bakery and I told you that uh, I was going to probably take it to work and share it. Well, that didn't happen. What ended up happening was I, um, now, listen, it wasn't just me. <laughs> I got to tell you, after I picked it up at the bakery, a friend of mine said, hey, come meet me for some pho, which is <clears throat> well, Japanese. I don't know, something. I don't know, but it's a bowl of soup, with, like noodle soup, and I've been dying for noodle soup. So I said, sure, I'll join you. So after we had pho, we got into this car, both of us. And we sat here for a half an hour and we picked out on that whole thing. And I didn't have a knife or anything, so I cut like the, the pastry in, uh, in half with like a, a um, credit card. <laughs> it was funny, we had a ball. Anyway, so that happened and that was a lot of fun. And let's see what else is going on this week. Um, not much, it's just, it's raining and um, 
this will help with the mountains to stay green and I hope you guys enjoyed my um, I need to get over I hope you guys enjoyed the um, <clears throat> the uh, the Buddha journal video that I posted this week that so that was this morning actually early got up early and made sure that that got posted for you because I won't be posting anything for till I don't know maybe Friday night or Saturday well tomorrow or tomorrow's Friday yay so yeah um, let's clean that off so yeah, so the, the most exciting thing that's happened to me this week was the um, the bakery. <laughs> and also going by those houses and taking a picture of those houses and comparing them to the picture of my house in Eugene. I thought that was really funny. And you know, it really just kind of makes me really excited, you know, about about everything. I'm just getting more and more excited as the time draws near. So. Anyway, you guys, I'm going to close. I'm going to hop on the freeway pretty soon. Not like it's ever stopped me before, right? But uh, I'll take the uh, advantage of stopping here at a light so that I can just shut off the video. And I will talk to you guys soon. It's Friday, and it's been a rough week. And I decided to um, go into the valley because on um, my Fridays, I get an hour. And so I have about an hour that will get me to the Daiso store and back. So I thought I would take you with me and you don't get much more San Fernando Valley than where we're going. So I thought I would take you with. Anyway, lots of traffic. It's about 12 something. I don't know what. And um, so I thought, well, let's just go. I don't want to be sitting here in traffic, but we are getting the next um, exit. So that's good. Fallbrook. Very Valley. So yeah, it's been a rough week. I've probably said that 10,000 times during this vlog, but it has. It just really has. And um, I want to tell you what I did to make it better. I uh, have been taking a class online, and I will tell you about that soon. And they used P.H. Martin's water color, Hydra's watercolors, and those things are expensive, you guys. I mean, oh my God, I had no business, but I had to. Because I tried doing stuff with regular watercolors last night, I was going to show you, but what a disaster! So I didn't. I so I'm like, uh-uh. I want these. These are what I want. So I got I got them ordered. I'm hoping to get them by Saturday. I don't know if you'll see them in this video or the next, but anyway, um, or a separate. Um, but I'm really excited about getting them and um, about telling you about the class online that you should probably take too. It's good. Anyway, so that was my way of helping me out of this week's awful dump. I hope this is my exit. I better say 28. Yeah, this is it. So anyway, um, yeah, so let's go to Daiso and check out what Daiso has. Look at that sign up that says Woodland Hills Canoga Park. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, yeah, that's Valley, peeps. That's Valley. But anyway, so when you hear about the San Fernando Valley, that's where it is. That's right here. So um, let's go to Daiso and see what they've got. I, I don't know how much longer or how many more opportunities I will have to go here. And there's not one in Oregon. They're, they're not a, in a lot of places. But So I thought, I'm going to hit up a Daiso before I go. And this is it. I'll be right back. We'll see what here, they got. There's Daiso Japan right there. So let's go check it out. I'm going to go incognito once we go in there. So I might not talk much. But I'll try to show you what I can without getting busted. Here's the belly. Oh, right on time. You should have seen the traffic coming down here. People were like cutting people off. I saw two people give each other the finger. Thought for sure we were gonna have road rage. Thank goodness we didn't. Yeah, thanks for stopping lady. People are so rude here. All right. I don't want napkins right now. And I already have some of these. So think about it. What are these? I don't know what those are. Oh, they're little, oh, they're bags. 
But they don't see the little clear thing right there. I think we're gonna have to get one of those. Those are neat. They have little stickers. What's this? Motif tie. Ooh, we have to grab one of those. Just stuff that I haven't had before. Look at these little drawstrings. Aren't those oh, I had to decline it. Okay, so let's see what else. Is this like tissue paper? Look at these. Oh my god. Oh no way. Are these stickers? Oh, they are stickers. They're wall stickers. Those are so cute. Yes, thank you. Come to mama. These are pretty too. Hold on. Look at the black cats. Let's see if there's anything else in there. No. And I'm not going to get the black kitties, but I do love these flowers. Those are beautiful. Okay, so those are really pretty. And this is like a tissue paper. Sakura remake sheet. Sakura. Sakura means sweet, I think. Uh, I don't, oh, they have adhesive on them. Let me think about those guys. I'm just I'm gonna, I'm trying to be good. <laughs> okay, I'll grab this. I better grab a basket. Hold on. Get my goodies in the basket. I don't even know. I think everything's like a dollar fifty here, so that's a good deal, right? Makeup. You know what I need? I need brow gel. You guys, bad. Let's oh, see. They have the LA color here. They have those at Dollar Tree too. I really need some brow gel, but I ordered some online. Look at this. I ordered some online, and um. I'm waiting for it. Okay. Okay, this is kind of... What is this? I mean, that's the iPhone case, you guys. Look, those are iPhone. These are four dollars. Little tassels. What's that? Little pen. Super cute. New iPad thing. Oh, you know what I got here before and I love them? I might grab one. I'll show you the neatest thing in the world. Hold on. Let me see if I can find it. They might not have it. Oh well. If they did, it would be like right there. I'm looking, it's like a, I'll tell you later. It's not a big deal, but it's pretty cool. Look at these iPad cases. What's this? Aww. Mm. Shoes? This is neat. I have to get one. Oh my, you guys. Like, yeah, I do. Let's look at this. Oh, the boxes. These are so cute. I love these boxes. I wonder if my daughter would want one. I don't know. Okay. Let's go back up this way first. Okay, just, this is cute. Isn't that adorable, you guys? Oh, look at this little bottle of lavender. I love that little tchotchke. Those are so cute. Oh, they feel heavy too. You guys, I might just have to get two of those. Just to put in my window. I have to have those. Those are so cute. I love those. Oh, look at these. So cute. 
Oh, I shouldn't have come here today. Okay, here we go. Sticker board. Chalkboard. Paint. Chalk. Chalk. These are cute. Aren't these adorable, you guys? It's like a dollar fifty. Sorry, got right in front of you here. <laughs> Sorry about that. Pen cases. Cute. Super cute. Oh. Super cute. Stencil brushes. Ooh. That's good for stamp making, right? Or maybe not. Sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> I changed my mind. But I'm going to let you go. Okay. Okay. How many is in here? Is it just one or ten? That's great. I think there's ten in there. I need that. I'm looking to see if there are any gel pens. This is where I got some really cool. And look at these, you guys. Let's go about one of those. This is cute. Some glitter pens. Oh, here's some gel pens, pastel. More darker ones. Let's see. I'm gonna grab these. Oh, you know what I need? I need a big. Um, I need some big erasers to make stamps out of. I'll have to ask them if they have anything like that. Oh, look. What's that famous Japanese artist? Feels pretty good. Is that metal? You can all pay for for two dollars, you guys. I think this is metal. Stamp. I'm getting that. I need that. Okay. And kitty supplies down here. I don't. Household goodies. I'm not here for that today. Oh, let's see. Oh, these are great. You know, just little cases and stuff. I'm sure I'm going to wish I got one, and I don't, but let's see. A little every day is catter day. I don't see any sketch pads though. Okay. 
Oh, these are cute. These are little indexing. So like if you like annotate your reading books or whatever, these would be really cute to annotate with. Aren't they adorable? Aw, these are cute. Oh, monkey shaped card, message cards, those are cute. Those would be fun to stick in a junk journal, wouldn't they? I think I'll grab one of those. I like those and I love these. These are so cute. Oh, here we go. These are small enough. These are great to add to your books when you're reading and you find something interesting. I like to annotate with those and I'm not going to write in them. They have manila folders, some cute folders. I know I'm passing a lot of neat stuff up, you guys, but I kind of have to because I can't buy everything, and um, I shouldn't buy anything. But so let's go look at the plastic stuff. She she texts me. She's like, "Excuse me, look at these. Aren't these cute, you guys? I love those. If they had a white one, I'd get one. Those are cute, but you can get these for a couple of dollars." at um these are beautiful aren't they see what i'm gonna wish that i had this store when i move into oregon right when i move into my place oh wow stick that underneath your computer it doesn't work like that excuse me goodness sakes they got so much stuff when I, when I walk by somebody, I put the video down because I don't want to video other people. I hope you guys get that. Okay. Those pools. Oh, somebody's. Isn't this pretty? A mellow mood. I am so gonna wish I had this store when I move, aren't I, you guys? I should probably try to remember, try to think about what I want from here before I go, right? Some cutting boards, aren't those cute? Oh, they're sheets. That's so cute. Mm. Life is a journey, little pouch. Go up this way, and then we'll look at the. Um, wouldn't this be fun to spray through? Like a stencil, mm, butterfly stencil, little mask right there. And some socks with some pretty see-through socks. Aren't those cute? And then they have the Japanese food here, which is to die for. I love their candy. Anything with rice paper. These are some little zipper bags, slider bags, gift bags, special recipes. Okay, let's look over here. Oh, those are cute, stylish shoes. Oh, okay, no, I should. Like I said, I couldn't buy everything, but. Oh, those are beautiful. There's two on there. So pretty. Ooh, glittery. Okay, and then what's over here? Little boxes. 
Well, I think I'm good. I've got a few little things. I, I can't go cray cray. in a shaker cart. Oh, look at his birthday hat, you guys. That is funny. <laughs> That's cute. California flags. Wine glasses. Or, I'm sorry, wine. Something or other. Well, I think we're just about good here. I do have to head back. So, I'm going to close and I'll show you what I got later okay guys well, I'm back hey how about that anyway so I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog this week um, right now there's not much else going on I'll start a new vlog shortly maybe later today because me and my daughter are going thrift store shopping and she's on uh, her spring break and so I am taking I taking the afternoon off oh, which is great I love taking the afternoon off to be with my kid and then um, so we're just gonna go thrift store shopping and um, hang out and which is really good because for work, you know, the struggle is real you guys It's like the farther the closer I get to being done the more I want to be done already I'm done stick a fork in me. I'm done, but I mean I'm buttoning things up. I'm preparing my head emotionally um, I'm really getting into the idea of uh, this whole new adventure and I can't wait to share it with you Um but anyway, that's about it. So I'm going to go ahead and button up this vlog, and I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, if you have a Daiso near you, go there. And if you have a fresh bakery, go there too. <laughs> okay, you guys, talk to you later. Bye.